Ladies and gentlemen, the age-old problem since the invention of motorized vehicles, one that I believe some of us here have been the unfortunate victim of, car theft, or in other words, Grand Theft Auto. Did you know that in Malaysia, a car is stolen every hour? 7,400 vehicles were stolen in 2020 alone, and according to the US, with the advanced surveillance and policing system, they were only able to recover about 50% of stolen vehicles. Just imagine, how about Malaysia? In Malaysia, existing smart visual systems are typically deployed onto fixed areas. However, some areas, especially those with increasing population in rural areas, are unable to capture accidents or crimes without the implementation of video surveillance systems. This results in uneven security coverage between areas. While we may not have the exact numbers, the current solution which is classified seems quite ineffective to the point where it receives a vote of no confidence from the general public. Netizens turn to social media in the hopes of reaching out to the public, seeking help, and praying constantly that someone, somewhere, may have gotten a glimpse of their family car. But no more, for we have the solution. We propose a system where cars on the road can detect license plates and which will then be uploaded into our database. And should the car be wanted, it will raise a red flag on the map and alert the authorities so that they may respond swiftly. The Road Hero, a smart on-road surveillance system. Now, I will fit a dashcam footage into our system to replicate real-life scenario for these demonstrations. From here, we can see the console which is going to print the detected license plate number, the video footage and the crop process detected license plate. From the demonstration, we see that if the dash cam is close enough with the car in front and is able to capture the license plate in sharp and clear image, the license plate number will be recognized successfully and along with the latitude, longitude, and timestamp, this data will be pushed to our cloud database. So, first things first, we must log on to our website. Over here, you can see a record of all the car plates that have been detected thus far. And if you would like, we can start pinning some of the car plates onto the map. So, Initially, we can see that this wanted car started out from Swimber and it starts to move along upwards up to New Atmosfera and is moving down towards the roundabout and towards King Center into Jalan Tunjuga. Let's see where it's going next. We know that the car's final destination as of this time and date is at Noms, Malaysia. In general, we can pretty much sum it up that someone stole the car from Swinburne University of Technology and decided to park it at Noms, Malaysia. This is how the police or the authorities can track down wanted cars from our road detection system. Through a small survey, it would seem that the general public is in support of our idea. However, though some not without their concerns, one proposed that we remove unwanted license plates from our system. However, this would render the system ineffective, as there is usually a gap of time before the car is reported as stolen. It would then be treated as a normal car. And it's usually in this gap of time that the whereabouts of where this car had been is crucial so that authorities can track it down. With this system, road users and car owners can rest easy. The authorities, especially during these trying times, will earn back the respect and trust of its citizens and make the streets safer for everyone. Let us make the worry of car theft no longer the looming giant it once was, but rather a trivial issue of the past. Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you the road hero.